Listen. Okay, I've been getting paid every way, trying to get it right. I just see the stage for it. That nigga said. I gotta get ready too. I gotta get ready to drop this box off. I told him we're gonna do the car review. Uh, I gotta return a box, man. I'm actually done with Xfinity. So, return the box. But nah, we got, the, uh, we got the Tesla truck review, and then we're gonna do that. Hey, how you doing? Welcome to Xfinity. What's going on hey, with you, brother? Going, man? Tired. But uh, just, just drop this box off. All right, man. I think that's all that come with it. All the other shit matter. Cause I just uh, hooked nah, everything. I and I need to uh, go ahead and cancel my stuff. Cause I ain't, where I'm at, ain't no, y'all yeah, ain't even there. Ooh. Unless y'all can send a train. Uh, train, train, what's that say, technician? Yeah. Out there, but they ain't gonna do that shit. We can. This nigga here always trying to pull one. What's up? What's up yeah. Oh, you filming with the DGI? Yeah. yeah. Okay. You fucking with the DGI? Yeah. Uh -huh. okay. I just got them today. Have you used that one before? Yeah, we got that one. Yeah, that's good. I didn't know it was like that. I didn't know it was like that. Yeah, yeah. That, that, you see that tall building? That, that oh, medium okay, building. Okay, that's okay. us. Okay, okay, okay. And I'm literally at the, at the top floor. You can see my shit. I'm at the 23rd floor on the on the right side. That's the that's the uh, crib I'm in. Mm -hmm. All right, so YouTube, this is our first time using uh, what we're using with the DGI, but we tapped in with my boy. He's got a new toy. Oh, yeah. I let him know, you know what I'm saying? What's the difference between them? Cause I, is there many different ones? Nah, this is, well, there, there are two. This is the, uh -huh. uh, there's a Cyber Beast, and then there's a Cyber Truck. Look at the white people. Yeah. <laughs> it's his car. <laughs> a, a Cyber Truck. Cyber Truck? Uh-huh. From who? Tesla. Tesla? Elon Musk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she looking like that. Like this one is hard. I never seen nobody uh, have tweezers for a cigarette. Oh, it's an alligator clip. It keeps just all of my hands. Oh, ah, okay. ah, she's smart. My fiance just got out of the hospital, and some of the medicines are making him really sensitive to smell. Mm -hmm. So I don't want it on my hands and getting him, making me throw up or something. Okay. okay. Consider it. Being considerate. Considerate. Yeah, yeah, that's the word of the month. How does it drive? Um, it's electric. No, I mean, like, is it smooth? Is it... Definitely. Is the acceleration like? Oh, it's fast, too. <laughs> that's nice. So, and then what's the difference with the ones that you said there's two of them? So what's the... Like, which one you got? One what's the different? I got, I got the best one. Uh-huh. So what's the difference? I have no idea. Damn. I just was, like, on some shit, like, let me uh -huh. buy it. But I know the Cyber Beast got more, um... Horsepower, but they're electric, so yeah, you know, uh -huh. but yeah. So like, all right, so just the progress of it. So what do you feel like that you like so far about the car? Like from any other car that you like, you drive Ooh, from what you can drive. One, it's a head turner, so when I'm uh -huh. when I'm driving around, everybody, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying. Oh, let me fix that. My fault. My chain all messed up. But yeah, right, fuck it. Ask that again. Yo, no, we are. We here. Video. We here. We out here. Let's get it. No, it's you. Oh, it's me. Tight shit. Let's get it. All right, what's nah. up? So, like, even with, all right, so, with this car right here. Right. So, you said it's the head turner. It's a head so turner. And, then, with, and how long you been driving it? A day. A day. So, with you driving it, does it feel hard to drive? Like, one of them cars, you know, when somebody say, let me move it, you be like, nah, nah, it's a way to do it. Like, you can't just up and boo this motherfucker, like, two right. minutes. Like, is it one of them cars where you... It is. Like, you need a touch screen. Like, you want to sit in it and yeah, come let's check do it. it out? You want to sit in the back so you can... Oh, show them the outside before we go in there. Right, so let's just... Let's, let's look at the outside. Yeah, lift. You can lift up the... Uh... Yeah, I seen that. So somebody on YouTube, the thing that they said about this, the lights in there. So basically, he had got inside the truck, and once you close it, the lights go away. So mm -hmm. basically, he got inside there to uh, try to figure out how you can get out, mm -hmm. and it's a panel. Did they show you the panel that you got, the emergency Ooh. panel? Oh, so like if somebody tried to trap you? Yeah, 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 something in there. But it's a panel in there that you got to get. But, uh, or do I think it's right here? Or no, that ain't it. But it's what, it's a button that you got in there. Just in case like if the kid get in there and they close it and then right. they try to get out. But it's a panel that he got in there. It was on YouTube, some dude showed. So when that closes, that light go out. It's probably in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's crazy. Okay. So how is it with the uh, scratches and shit? Did they explain um, that to you? It's like bulletproof. Uh. Yeah, it's bulletproof. So uh -huh. this, 
but I watched the video, only a 40 cal can get through this. Mm -hmm. So like a sniper. Mm -hmm. But like a regular pistol can't get through it. Hmm. Yeah, that shit crazy. Washing, what well, car wash, shit like that. Like certain car washes, you can't go through. Did they explain that to you? Or is uh, it like hand wash only? Did you look into that? I'm like, gonna get it wrapped. Uh huh. So I'm not even. But they, what they said was stainless steel. You gotta wipe it down with stainless steel remover. So it's stainless steel. And so stainless steel is like the ovens and shit like that. That's what it looked like on mommy, yeah. like an oven or some shit. Where if it get grease or some shit like that, it just go through with it. And wheels, and then with changing them, if you want to change them, like what's the wheel lock on it? It's easy to change the wheels. I think you can only you gotta go through Tesla to get everything repaired or this and that. So I already know it's, it's kind of mm -hmm. like having a Ferrari. I got a Ferrari, so I got to go through Ferrari to get it fixed, mm -hmm. oil change, anything like that. So I probably got to go through Tesla to, to get all that done. So I'm at the quiz real quick. How many cameras they got on the outside? It's a great question. See, he not asking none of these questions. Like he just got this shit. Like you know, so do you hey, think like how many cameras they got on the outside? Cause so this far, was a little cool. Yeah, I'm buying it. I don't know none of the spec. I got to research today, actually. Yeah, I just yeah. Go on YouTube, research everything about it. Mm -hmm. um, window replacement. We're breaking in cars. Did you check in that? What is the window? Is it easy to break the windows? And how much it is to replace the motherfuckers? If somebody was to do that, I'm be mad as a motherfucker. Somebody do that. But uh, yeah, it's gonna cost some money. But I did got you it. see if it's hard? No, they ain't, I'm just saying, is it hard to do? Like, is it, is it good? Or That's a great question. I asked them about the windows, and I know they, they're thick windows. We can actually this one. I mean, they are kind of thick. That is a thick window. And then the glass, I wonder how long it take the replacement. Like, that shit, like, just, this just sucks. Because when you're in Atlanta, you got to think like that. That's what's fucked up. Cause like, you know what I'm saying? You get something like this, you just want to be, like you deserve this shit. Don't fuck with my shit. But the good thing about Tesla is they don't fuck with them cause the camera's on them anyway. So I don't really right. see camera, like Tesla's getting fucked with cause of the cameras mm -hmm. on it. Cause nigga, you on camera now, exactly. you, you know what I'm saying? So, and then you got to sit in the back seat. Did you sit in the back seat before you bought it? Nope. Let so me. you ain't got to see. <laughs> and this is shit I didn't do when I got cars. Like I didn't sit back there to see if it was like comfortable back there. It is. How you feel about it? Like with the leg room? Actually, lots of leg room, and I'm six two, so mm -hmm. that's a that's good leg room to be six two. It's actually pretty comfortable. You sit in. Let me show you. Let me let me know how you feel about it. So, in an hour drive, if I had to sit in here for, yeah, you could do it. I could do. I could do two hours, three hours in this bitch. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely comfortable. No, Cause I ain't gonna lie, that's the one thing I when I uh I bought like the X six. I didn't sit in the back. Like of it, cause like all you think, like you instantly when you buy a car, you sit in the front. Right. But I was like, damn, what if I got somebody driving sitting in the back? Like, let me see how the back feel. You know what's crazy? I was about to buy that car. Uh, no, nah, you said it was dope. One. Yeah. Because yeah, that one is, is real dope. Do you got the uh, the TV? The TV in the back. Yeah, I got the TV in the back. But the thing with that is, it comes with the cell phone. So basically, you got to get with AT and T, and they got to hook it up. But like, so it's a phone. It's another phone line, but it's been down. So people that got those. Not something that's in the TV ain't working. So I've been having this since what October. Ain't, the TV don't because it ain't got no internet I was about service. Because is it a, is yours electric or you got? No, nah, it ain't. It's just a regular one too. But I ain't got the electric one. I didn't really look into it. That's why I'm asking questions that I didn't ask. I just seen it. I wanted it, and then I start learning about other ones. Like fuck, I should have waited. I just seen the waited? TV. I like that one though. Yeah, but no, nah, it's different ones that got different shit. Like it's ones yeah, that yeah. got reclined in the back too in the seats. I didn't you know that. Got that one? No, it just got the TV, but it's one that, that you Yours push. Yours don't decline in the back. No, it don't. It nah, just, you just sit down. Me that. But I didn't know they had it. I just seen the one with the TV, and now I just like, that's the one. Because mm -hmm. they told me, they showed me the one without the TV. So I'm thinking the one with the TV got it's everything. the one, yeah. Yeah, but it's different ones to it. That's what I was asking yeah, you. Yeah, fully loaded one. Yeah, that's what, yeah, that's what I was asking. I mean, yeah, that's true. I, don't, I wonder if the seat moves in the back. I mean, but that's already comfortable. They did their yeah, thing on there. And then this right here, you feel like this like good storage space right here too. That's storage space right there. Yeah, that is. Yeah, so that shit, that's dope because they usually don't have that on the car thing. I wonder if you could, that'd be dope if there's a button you could push it down or some shit. You can lay down in that motherfucker. Nah, that would. You can get them beds though. You know, you know they got them inflatable beds. Yeah. You can put in the back seat, mm -hmm. have sets, lay down. Yeah. yeah. Freaky. Ah, <laughs> uh, door. Open it. How you open the door? It's the. It's the. Oh, how you open push, the door? Push this. Do it go out fingerprint? Uh, I don't think so. That shit would have been dope. 
if it just did like who you assigned a fingerprint. So like if some yeah. They are yeah, they they carry every fingerprint though. So you'll know who touched that shit. You know what this mean right here? What? I don't know. Cyber. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's hard. So, all right, so Elon Musk really designed this motherfucker? That's what that's the story behind this? I should have did my research. Did he? I don't know. I, was asking, I, I thought you said that. I don't think so. I, I that's a great So question. and then some the thing is, all right, somebody told me how you feel too. They was just like, these one of the trucks that you should wait to get because you want to figure out what's all bam bam and then get the second version of it. How you feel I, about it? I thought of that too, but at the end of the day, I thought with the Corvette, I bought the 2020 Corvette and I bought mm. the 2022. So if that happens, these shits only the moment they say they coming out with a second, I'm just gonna put my name on the waiting list. Yeah, so that's what it is right now. It's a waiting list for people to get these motherfuckers. Get these, so yeah. don't get fucked. How much money you got? No, no, no. You can go to the dealership and uh, like I bought this one. They really cost 88k, but I bought mine for like 160. Mm. Double. So, uh, so, so they, they selling them for double at the dealerships right now. Right. Okay. So basically, they doing like some ghetto shit. Basically, like the plug, like how they was with the yeah, PS5. Yeah, exactly. But they sold out like. Uh, Atlanta Autos had six. Zaytoven came and got one. Playboy Cardi came and got one. Damn. I saw Zaytoven at the dealership buying it at the same time I was buying it. Uh -huh. Were you just recently, like this right now? They just yesterday. Like me, Zaytoven, everybody was at the dealership yesterday. Damn. Yeah. That's nice. Uh, damn, damn. That's I was one more motherfucking question I had to ask you. It was good. Uh, blind spots. Would you driving it? Do you feel like it got real bad? Like, like you got to really with the blind spots? Do you feel like they really good? Only thing is you can't see out the back, like uh, the mirror. You can't like this mirror is useless. Like you got to use a uh, electric camera. Mm -hmm. yeah, Cause it remind me of uh, it remind me of the Camaro window, like the Camaro, shit. and then the the fact that they set lower is just like that. Okay. The front. That shit crazy. Oh, uh, headlights. What happened with the headlights? If they did they tell you replacement on it? Did you look at the numbers? Um nah, that's a great question. I, I ain't look at none of that before I bought it. Mm -hmm. Nah, you can do that. Go ahead. No, no, y'all find this part. Oh, yeah, we did. No, 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 you're good. It's all right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, go ahead. This is a man, I'm doing what y'all doing. Right. Yeah. So all around draw car, you feel all around. Like, oh, uh battery, how is it? How long they say you can drive? They said three hours, but I gotta I gotta uh, download the Tesla app, and mm -hmm. then uh, yeah, it, it'll be like thirty minutes for a full charge. Mm -hmm. I think I, it's like a Tesla supercharge. You already got thing, subscription and you got you it you at your house for. where you stay already the charge. Yeah, so I show you. Come here, I show you. Thank you. Yep. Appreciate it. I literally just got it today. Congratulations. And some Louis Vuitton shots. <laughs> <laughs> she said, and some Louis Vuitton shots? Yeah. <laughs> so, um, this is how it is. That's the packet with the pieces, right? Where you yeah, got different charger. clips. So, yeah. what it is is, let me show you one here. Actually, I'll show it on the ground. Or, hold it real quick, hold it. So, this piece, is what you when with. you got the three outlet yeah when you got the three outlet so i got a three car garage so it's dope mm -hmm. and then you put it in here mm -hmm. and then you uh put this in the outlet and then you charge it with this mm -hmm. and then you gotta click this to uh before you put it in click mm -hmm. that put that damn in. so did you went straight to this tesla you ain't really had the other tesla nah, either nah i bought my mom a, uh bought my mom a tesla cash like mm -hmm. two years ago but you get to draw that, so you got an nah, idea? I never, I never Also, drove. you just skipped the stages. Okay, yeah. Right. So he did skip. I don't skip. even know how to. Shoot that and then, so I do know certain, uh, damn, what was that? What, what was the one I bought my mom? What was that called? X. Model X. Yeah. Yeah, I bought that one. That one cost like 120 racks. I spent that cash, though. In the wheel. Let me see. So when the, with the wheel... That shit really look like a game. Do it feel like it feel like a game? You feel like it feel like a game? Um, like with the wheel. I'm saying like the way how it's shaped. It do feel like that. Like the drive, the wheel is actually comfortable. The most comfortable wheel I ever drove. Where you feel like a good place to put your like your fire weapon besides the door? 
what? Like your fire weapon, like your gun. What do you feel like the best place to put the oh, motherfucker? Yeah. I'm saying, but you, when you in your car, <laughs> I said because I'm like, person. nah, hell no. Nah. I'm saying when you driving, you know, in your shit, pocket. Man, Sal, that motherfucker on me, goddamn. Cause that motherfucker, it look, yeah, that's like a small out. one. Wild, wild, wild west. But when you in your pocket like that, like right here, wouldn't be bad either. Like, nah, hell no, nah. pocket. What you mean in your pocket? Like while you driving, you? I'm left handed. That <laughs> one coming out, right there. Oh damn! So damn, this is look at this. This is really small, like the mirror. You wow! Out of it. Wow! You can get in here. Go in there. Show that. Yeah, yeah, show that. That shit. What's your favorite thing in it? Like so far from you driving, like damn, I like this. Ooh, the awkward thing I that just happened say... to you. Pedal, I feel like some what's something that I you would do. say the drive is very smooth, mm -hmm. but I'm gonna be honest with you, the way that motherfucker turn head, like everybody got their camera out when I'm on the highway. Yeah. Everybody like And then your face is marketable, like your face is everywhere, so that's dope too, marketing. You think so? Yeah, man, what? If you you can see everywhere. Yours too, but I'm saying like uh, yours is really like you don't question, like I told you, when you with people, you don't question, like, you know, like, you done built your portfolio, like, oh, that's old dude, like, yeah. you don't question, like, how the fuck he next to that person, like, right. when you see in the videos with the gorillas and that, it's like, you him, like, you know what I'm saying, like, yeah. I've been doing this, you don't question in that, sometimes, like, how the fuck he get next to that, like, you know what I'm saying, Yeah, for sure. that's just that, that even with true. the podcast, and you do got a dope podcast, and then if you can break down to him, like, the meaning of your podcast, and what's your point, like, a direction when you... And you do you call it a podcast? Because I hate when people just call shit call podcast. It, right. I call it whatever is marketable. So if it's podcast, that's what we call yeah. it. I call it, some people say call it a show. Mm -hmm. So they don't confuse the two. But I, you know, as long as mm -hmm. the money making, you know, it makes sense. But I'm going to say this. I came up with a show called Kicking It With The OGs because I felt like being a successful young entrepreneur, the reason I'm there is because of OGs, but people don't know. Like, that's how you get there faster. So it's a disconnect between young dudes asking older guys for advice. So I said, I'm going to come out with a show where it sets the example of I'm young and rich and mm -hmm. can reach out to the OGs. What's stopping you who's young and poor thinking you know everything, mm -hmm. but you can't tap in with the older men and, and get advice mm -hmm. from them. So it was that. But I didn't know how monumental it would be. I just was coming out with a concept. I had no mm -hmm. idea it would explode, like for real. So, with that being said, did you did you look up the trademark? You get the trademark. With that yeah, being, yeah, is yeah. somebody already tried, like with that? Because it sounds like a, it's a popular name already. It's yeah, catchy. Yeah, so I, I trademarked it already. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. But when I you looked into it, was you surprised that it wasn't trademarked? Nah, because kicking it with the OGs, that's like a four-letter word. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then who's thinking about them right now? Everybody mm -hmm. thinking about the rapper. It sounds like a movie that. though. Kicking it with the OGs. It sounds like a movie. Because like. that's how I... I, I yeah. like to have conversations with older men. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm so wise. Like, yeah. I have a whole soul because I actually enjoy talking to... Experienced uh, people that have been here. Like Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. I, I enjoy talking to them because, mm -hmm. they, for one, they're funnier, they're more animated, and they think totally different from us. Like, what year mm -hmm. were you born? 93. 96. Yeah, so you're, like, yeah. right there. That's what I was just saying with the... I say, well, we got to accept with the time changing. Like, our heart grandmas and them looking at shit, like, it's changing. We got to say, think of the same shit. So when people get their nail polish and shit, I don't judge them because that's just what the time is right now. That's what they doing, but we never grew up on that. You feel me? So I, I learned to stay in our year. Like, that's like what LeBron James, like, classes are changing. Like, remember, they wore baggy clothes. And, like, when they was hooping and shit, Stephon Marbury had big-ass shorts, and now they were in little, like, they went from little, baggy, now to back. So it's like... As your yeah. transition is kind of like, videos used to hit different back then. We had 106 right. in part. Like, like I said, uh, it was another thing I talked about. Um, Cause we used to find our news from like MTV, like news, breaking news on MTV. Remember, that's how we found out about, now they got the shade room. Like right. we got to realize like time is changing and time you just got to adjust, but mm -hmm. you can't really argue with what the fuck. Like you said, King of OGs, we going to be OGs to tell them this how the shit used to be, but we accepting how y'all are now. I'm not going to body shame you or make you feel bad for what you're doing because you're you're keeping up with your culture like we did. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So for sure. that's a big thing. And the fact you was riding in the back, you don't mind being on camera, do you? No, no. How was it like riding in the back? How you feel riding in the back? See, I feel like the smooth got a lot of power to it too. Uh -huh. For electric car, it's pulling like got a lot of pulling power. Yeah. So. I'm a fan of Elon Musk, man. Like mm -hmm. entrepreneurship, innovation, um, everything that he's doing inspires me mm -hmm. as a young black millionaire. People like him 
push me. Um, I'm pushed by black millionaires too, but I like, you know, I feel like thinking big mm-hmm. is how you get far. You yeah, know what I'm saying? You shoot for the stars, you land on the moon type shit. That's mm-hmm. my theory. So I'm just, I'm shooting past the, you know, yeah. past the stars. Mm-hmm. And then it just takes me far, you know? Yeah. That's why I feel like overthinking get you like, get you like, I feel like overthinking hurt you. Like when you just like, fuck yeah. it, I get it. Like yeah. even with this, did you go on the intentions like, I know I'm gonna buy it or you just went in like, I'm gonna just see what the fuck's happening, but. I knew I was gonna buy this car. I mm-hmm. didn't care if somebody was charging 300 racks for this shit. Give yeah. it to me. Because, <laughs> because the marketing behind it, you see how people coming up, taking pictures, yeah. doing this and that. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't even got no logos, no nothing. Like, mm-hmm. it, it sells itself. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna do YouTube videos on it. So, I bought it mm-hmm. for 160 ish. Mm-hmm. And the amount of money I plan on making from YouTube, from people like yourself making mm-hmm. videos, things like that. It's astronomical, but at the same time, I wanted a four seater anyway. Yeah. But I wanted something futuristic. Mm-hmm. So I told myself, instead of buying a Rolls Royce, I want something. I was going to buy that at first, mm-hmm. the uh, BMW i something, but like that hit the streets and went wild. So yeah. I, like, I want something like exclusive, futuristic, mm-hmm. um, that's great for marketing, because mm-hmm. that's really what I'm about. Yeah. You know, yeah, yeah. Everybody about different shit. What's you know what another item that you feel like you didn't got? Before mm-hmm. other people got to that you can call besides this Ferrari, uh-huh. I was the first young nigga with a Ferrari in in Atlanta mm-hmm. who, without rap uh, or um, being an athlete. I'm the first young nigga with this without rap mm-hmm. and being an athlete. Mm-hmm. So I'm all and even the Corvette when the 2020 Corvette came out, first mm-hmm. first young dude in Atlanta to have it. Um, and what else? I was I was the first I was the first young dude entrepreneur to fly the private jet. That's all. Uh, so I was doing that before. So look, I'm gonna stop. We ain't gonna give him too much game yeah, on that yeah. because I want to. I'm gonna <laughs> hey, sit down. I told him I want to go. Yeah, I, I want to go on his podcast and I want to talk about the real shit. So, oh, yeah, for sure. like I said, besides that, I just want to, you know, tap in with him because this is dope that he got this. And I'm like, damn, this shit real. And seeing people get it and then they get it how they want to get it hit different. Like I said, like you can get a lot of shit in ways that you're not happy with how you got it. If that's that true. makes sense. That's and true. that's why I told, like, you know, what I'm saying me having female friends and it's like if a nigga buy it it hit different versus you working your ass off with your salon or your hair company and you going to get it versus mm-hmm. somebody handing it to you like and I know you work hard and I know like you know what I'm saying that's dope to be able to be next to you knowing the shit is real like you didn't take no shortcuts so right. you deserve everything you got and like you said when you say the 300k shit it's like nigga I'm gonna get it because I deserve the shit like you know what I'm saying that's mm-hmm. why I feel like when you go into something with no intentions and you just know what's right, this shit right. Like, nigga, you wake up every day and you know you're gonna breathe because you're supposed to. You don't wake up and be like, oh, this shit working? Like, you just know this shit yeah. is right, and that's how you're supposed to treat your career and just going after it and just keep going, and you know what I'm saying? And that shit dope. And it's just dope to see that you got this shit, and it's just like, as much as I see them, it just hit differently. Like, I gotta tap see in with, bro. It. Yeah. With you, like, because I know you did it your way to get it. Like, you know what I'm saying? And it's just like, it worked, got you this shit. <laughs> like, yeah, sure. That's it, just me being me got you this fucking car. Like, you know what oh, I'm saying? Yeah. And the other shit is, is just that. Like, you know what I'm saying? That shit dope. The window shit, how do you feel about the window? Like, how it's, it's flatted, flatted in, like, just with driving? To be honest, bro, it feel like I'm driving, like, a, a mini school bus. Mm-hmm. I'm sitting up high. Uh, I'm still, I wish this was a little higher. You can lift, can you lift it? Yeah, you can. It has a lift on it. Oh, wow. I don't know how to yet. I'm saying like what you, like that, you probably gonna go pay for that shit. No, 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 dude, lift it. He lift oh. It. I gotta see though. Let me press car. Ride high, high. Oh, it wow, it's wow. Look. It's lifting? Yeah, lifting. yes. You can't feel it? Nah. <laughs> that shit, <in> <laughs> Yo, that bitch didn't <laughs> yeah. yeah. He just lit that bitch on it too. That's hard. Yeah, it do got a lift on it. Okay. This is amazing. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, let me see. We doing I'm over here looking at this is nice. This is Yeah. Wow. So what's that? What's the difference you just did? I did, I did low. Yeah, then it go high. I want to see how it lift high, though. I got to see that from the outside. Alex. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah, that's all right. So what's it? It's video. 
Oh, look at this heart. Look, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> look, you gotta get up there. Look. <laughs> yeah. Oh, nice. This is my car. Yeah, this is nice. That's nice. That's lovely, like just to see, like. And it, it just, it just seems so. It's his car, yeah, you go, yeah, yeah, do your thing, yeah, yeah. Y'all want to take a picture? Y'all want to take a picture? Okay, I can do it for you. Go ahead, y'all got it. Go ahead. You do it? Oh, you want me to get in? You want me to get in? Oh, let's get in. Let's go. I'm with him. I want you. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Those boyfriends. boyfriend. Yeah. What's the uh what's the measurements? Or they had they told you what you can't drive through or what to watch out for? Cause nah, it's something. I, got, I gotta go and like once I get on YouTube tonight, I'ma feel like So then they tell you on the dealership, like, all right, these are things like you can't go through this or watch out for the hype. They did say uh fingerprints. They was like people touching yo. They said that's the only thing they said you might want to get it wrapped because and then you gotta you can't wipe it off like with just anything. Mm -hmm. It gotta be stainless steel, wipe yeah, off, yeah. like specific. So that's one thing. So a normal say. car wash won't do shit for it. Mm-mm. I don't think so. That's what I'm saying. Like he just got this motherfucker look. <laughs> he yeah. just said, I know I'm gonna get it and I'm gonna figure the shit out. Like, and that's dope because now the questions I'm asking you, then we gonna come back, you gonna know the shit. Like, that's that shit. This motherfucker right. nice though. This is, yeah. and it's dope. That's what I said, just to make people day to see this shit. That's hard. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. everybody keep walking. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Like, yeah. everybody just keep walking up. Yeah. Can I get a YouTube? Can I get this and that? I ain't know what bro was asking for at the mall. Like, oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I thought you said he want me to go and go somewhere else. He no, wanted no, a video on the spot. Yeah, you're on the spot. Oh, I would have did that. Oh, okay. I thought he was talking about like no, no, no. Just YouTube. I no, I like nah, bro. I can't just pull up nowhere. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. That's hot. I wonder how it is. So the, like, with the hot one, it's real, real hot. Like, is it? It don't do shit. Shoot, it's probably going to when the, when the sun come out. This thing, the outside of this motherfucker gonna be blazing. Yeah. Why you don't touch it? Yeah. 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 The kid better not. Well, yeah, sun, sun out. better not. You gotta keep the kids away from. Ah, right, and then this got ah uh, damn, we got the little TV back there. Can you control the music? I don't even know how to turn this bitch off. Hot, the thing you, is, you gotta you gotta drive it from the touchscreen. Like, and I want y'all to subscribe. Look, the questions he don't know, make sure y'all subscribe to his YouTube channel because he's gonna break down all this. So it's oh, yeah. dope. Sure. He gonna break down all this, and it's just motivation. You know what I'm saying? And everybody on my channel that don't know about him, tap in with him because he he dope as fuck. Like you know what I'm saying? And I want to tap in with them, I'm just, you know, energized, like, just seeing you from other people, from young DC flies to gorillas, and just how you move, like, it's just, mm -hmm. that's the right, it's really ghost, off pirate, because he's just like a ghost, he just end up just places and shit like that. That's yeah, that's <laughs> you might hard. see me just yeah. shit, yeah. yeah, but it come from, I got the money to, like, spend sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So it's like, I don't even be intentionally trying to be where celebrities be. Mm -hmm. You ever realize, like, you be somewhere where people spend money because you got money and then you Same thing, when you money. just bought this. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, like, yeah, I saw that yeah. at the at the car dealership. So mm -hmm. I always tell people, if you mm -hmm. want to increase your network, be where people who have money be. And I swear they're going to be there, like... And that's how you meet yeah. good people. That's what I said, when you... Well, not even good people, I, you meet the people that you want to meet. Yeah. If you go to a Louis Vuitton store you and you're going to meet Louis Vuitton type of people, but if you go to the fake Louis Vuitton, you're going to meet them type of people. If you go to Starbucks, you're going to meet them. And that's why I started going to Target because I was like, because Walmart, that shit. Yeah, right. <laughs> hey, Walmart, I didn't know why. I'm a big fan of Walmart, if y'all know, but I'm like, that shit different. Like, it's, it's just a lot of shit going on in there. And I'm like, bro, I got to start going to Target. I be seeing I got... celebrities at Whole Foods. Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Is that what it's called? Sprouts? Yeah, 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 yeah. I be yeah. seeing them there. I be where else I And it's say. good just to change your mindset on shit. Because yeah. I know you growing up, you from like the hood and shit. You going to Whole Foods, your mama right. cuss you out. But the fact that you're doing it, passing it down to your kids, let them know, like, you can go there. And you can go this, too. You can go this route. But you able being an open book, trying new shit and, like, taking risks for your universe, you know what I'm saying? Your sure. people and shit, like, that shit crazy. And then I felt like, too, like, I feel like when people buy this, they don't even want to film content with it, they don't want to show people about it, and I'm like, man, I would love to show people the yeah, insides, yeah, 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 yeah. what I like, dislike, but so far, I don't dislike anything besides, I would say the drive so far is kind of 
it's a, it feels like I'm driving a big old rectangle. Cause it's yeah, you so gotta learn. It's something new. You gotta, it, yeah, you gotta train. You gotta to train it. your like, shit. My wife got a G wagon, but mm -hmm. this is feels bigger than the G wagon. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. So that shit is nice. And then how you feel about this? With this, do you feel like this should have been black, or how do you feel about this? And in fact, that it could get dirty real easy and just kind of just shit, we get gonna, it from that. We might get that. You know, we we might just customize this whole thing because it's mine. Yeah. I own it. Like mm -hmm. I didn't. You know, this ain't no lease. Mm -hmm. This is owned by Aristotle, so yeah. So but did they have different interior? Like, did you get to watch the other ones? Nah, they all look the same. Oh, okay, That's okay, the okay. only thing I wish Tesla would do differently. Stop making everything cookie cutter. Mm -hmm. Everything is kind of cookie cutter. That's that's the reason I never got like whatever. What, what's that? That's the one I bought my mom. I think. Nah, is that the uh, is that the one with the butterfly wings? The X? No, nah, no, nah, 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 that's just a normal. Yeah. Okay. And how? I'm trying to try it like, oh, okay. this right here. Yeah. yeah that's dope. The door is now, heavy, that's though. That's the one thing I would say is scary to me. What? To make it go is touchscreen, to make it park is touchscreen, to make it do anything is touchscreen on that, on Damn. that thing. So basically, you, you're depending on a computer for everything. Every you peep this out. Look at this. So I just seen that, too. I wonder if it's because you can hear it, too. So when you open the door, let's say if you accidentally open it real quick, and then you just try to push it. You can't pull, you gotta pull it and you can hear it. So it's like a thing right there blocking it. That shit, that shit mm. different. That's hard. You didn't even push it to make it go. Hold nah, on. so I guess it's something that's like stopping it. So like you. But oh. just imagine it, just try to open it without it and you like, oh shit, let me go ahead. You can't close it. Hmm. You gotta open it back. Okay. He discovering shit about the car before I can. He right, you can't close it. You gotta open it back. And then, okay. Yeah, that shit. This is my fucker. These, 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 you gotta do like, like ten YouTube videos on this shit. I told you, the trunk is one thing. That is one thing. To... But again, y'all, I want y'all to check out this YouTube. Make y'all, make sure y'all subscribe. Like, you know what I'm saying? This on the humbug. So, it's just the fact that he enjoying. Look at this. This is hard too. Like, yeah, that's hard. Imagine if the whole car looked like this. Whatever the fuck that was. Whole motherfucker black <laughs> type shit. But nah, make sure y'all tap into his YouTube. Make sure y'all subscribe and I'm gonna get on the show. That's one thing. And what, with me not being an OG, how I get on the show though? Right, so we're gonna do our own thing. I got this thing. So called, is it called OG? Oh, that, nah, okay. It's called Money Talks. Mm -hmm. So, like, you know, Money Talks. So it's about not only financial literacy, but like, you know, mentality, everything. Like, one thing I don't do is ask people no drama questions because I don't mm -hmm. believe in that. That's not my lane. Right, right. You know, I'm catering to the people, to my audience, which are the mm -hmm. people who just want to elevate mentally and financially. Mm -hmm. Those are the my main focuses. Yeah. Mental health, financial health. Everything else is kind of, you know, it'll fall in line if you got yeah. those two right. Do you agree with that? Yeah, I agree. I'm the same way. I don't really, I just kind of I see you doing your thing, though. Like, you got your, um... You did get out of that. You not know. You yeah, know, like, I'm out of that. People yeah, yeah. Who, when we mm -hmm. was at that studio. Yeah, you know, yeah. Man, like, out of that okay. too. That and just just bought my first home, so it's different. Like with that and learning about that, just property and about to get a pool built. But the same thing, like just like how you feel. Like for instance, I know I want to. I'm instantly getting a pool built in the house. Like, but I was like, should I sit and wait and I figure it out? You should it but then, if you got them, but no, nah, I just did it. Yeah, I just, shit. yeah, that's all I'm like, just do it. Shit. But you know, and then, like I said, that pool could be an investment too to get back. Like, damn, I'm glad I did it. So, that's one thing of when I feel like people say, like, with their money or being cheap or strategized, sometimes you just got to just live with like money is just a reward. But when you living and you living how you want to live, that's the reward to it. So, this is a reward. This about to, you about to get that shit back. Like, the reward is just that. And you, I got to go give back too. I'm about to go give back like maybe like a 10 racks cash to like. Young boys out, so I'm about to go get yeah. that pretty soon. See, that's dope, like, man. Yeah. Yeah, God just blessed you. You blessed him back. That's just, that's that's dope, bro. That shit hard. I'm going to pay 100 young men to come learn $100. Mm -hmm. So 10000 That's dope. And when you doing it? I already did one back in the day, but I do another one. So mm -hmm. I'm about to do that soon. I got to connect with uh, Next Level Boys Academy. Mm -hmm. So do you, is it somewhere you go and you like pass it out or like what area? Because if you can, if I'm here, I want to go do it with you. That'd be dope Girl. as fuck. Yeah. Oh yeah. I see what you're doing. Shit. I, I, won't, I definitely won't, you know, it depends on how much you want to sponsor. Every mm -hmm. kid is $100 mm -hmm. to come learn financial literacy. Yeah. Free. 
Mm-hmm. So we're paying them to come learn. The only way you can get the money is if you stay to the end of the class. Yeah. So that's dope. So we're gonna teach them like quick lessons, but we learn we can't. They got a short attention span, so we're gonna mm-hmm. teach them like 25 minutes of stop, 25 minutes of credit, and 25 minutes of uh, maybe one more topic, little beginners mm-hmm. real estate. And that's good because I'm I'm, ADHD. I'm bringing my experts, so yeah. the people I know know what they talking about. Mm-hmm. Like if you don't got the, you're not as knowledgeable at stocks as I am in your field. Mm-hmm. Like I mean, I'm bringing the best real estate guy to come speak to them. And he pitching in some money too. So if you want to as well, mm-hmm. however much you want to, I'm mm-hmm. sponsoring a hundred kids, a hundred dollars, ten thousand cash. Mm-hmm. You want to do twenty kids, two thousand, mm-hmm. ten kids, one thousand. You know, and you can pick your own, or yeah, I can just put out the word. Just whoever feel it, shit. God will just send us right to him. Yeah, like just, this, the just one sponsor as, as much yeah. as you want to, even if it's one kid, a hundred dollars. That shit'll help for them to oh, learn. Oh, that's dope. And that's what, and that's another thing I say is about the future, like them right here not the grown people because as you hear like that we can really motivate them to push them like them right here like i'll be like hey where i'm from from Kansas city i want to put a community center in my city for the kids to be able to play ball and go and do that like but if you grown you didn't you, you, you grown motherfucker like i can't really do nothing for you but we can help the youth though like the little people so that's dope though oh, yeah well, we, we we pay them to learn something i host an annual event that's what I wanted to do. Mm-hmm. Like, and I feel like that shit gonna change the game, especially if we can get other celebrities to chip in. Like, look, every hundred dollars is for is for one kid. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? And then they that kid came, you know, got paid to come learn. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Not only we giving back, but we giving them information to do with the money. Mm-hmm. Or, you know, go go buy yourself some Jordan, have fun. I don't give a damn what you do. You can't you can't buy shit with a hundred dollars these days, really, but mm-hmm. it's still like something. The time. The motivation. Mm-hmm. Are you gonna get custom tags? Like, do you do that with your name or something on it when you do these toys? Or are you just leaving normal? What you mean? Like with your tags? Are you gonna do like a custom tag or put your name? I've you never do done that, but I might do it this time. I feel like you should. With your initial your IG name or something. Yeah, I'm. A, I'm gonna put. Uh, I'm definitely gonna put my IG on here somewhere though. I'm gonna yeah. get it wrapped first, but I gotta go to Turks and Caicos yeah. in like two days. So that's what's up. Yeah, me and me and everybody you just saw, we going to. Uh, that's what's up, to, and that's one thing I. Every time I see you, you are out with your people and you giving them, like, you just shopping with them, having fun. Every time I see this nigga, like, and that's the dopest shit. And that's what I try to explain. Like, I, it's rare that you see that where it's like, I, it feel like you make money. Like, you'll be good without money, but you just know that it helps other people. So exactly. it makes you good. Like, I swear to God, you just got that touch and I see it through people. And that's how I am. Like, when I was just telling my assistant, Devin, when she's like, you got to pee people that blah, 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 I try to use it. I'm like, I'm not thinking like that. God going to show me what I need to be around. And so, I'm going to still be me. If I'm giving, that's just what it is. Because at the end of the day, you teaching them to do the same shit as it is. And if you look at it as, as a lick, your mindset, you already losing. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it's just opportunity as bros, sisters, like, pass this down, do the same shit because we ain't here forever. So right. this money passed down, you you hit something big, just do it and have fun with it. And I get it too from my grandma too, cause she raised me. I just seen my grandma share her money so much, it felt good. Like, you know what I'm saying? She just used to just give us every motherfucking thing we wanted and it mm-hmm. felt good. So knowing that she did that, I know she felt good doing it. So I'm like, bro, I feel good being able to get back and go live and get fans money. That's what you say when you do that, just to help mm-hmm. people out and have merch and sell it for $20 because the money gonna come, but just the experience and being able to have something, a moment with you because we ain't here, whatever, but like, mm-hmm. damn, I remember when he gave me $100, like, I respect that. Oh, like, yeah. you're leaving moments with people, even though that, that money gonna go fast. I feel, feel like, me? and it's crazy, no disrespect to the church, but it's mm-hmm. like, I tell people, I feel better mm-hmm. giving $10,000 away hundred dollars. Mm-hmm. Oh no, we good. Kids. How y'all doing? Y'all want to? Yeah, and we we doing the same thing. This is his car. He checking it out. No, it's, it's nice. Just like, yeah. What, what, we, you can't not see it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> what is what what is it? Uh, um, a cyber truck by Tesla. Elon. That's Musk. what I thought. Okay. You never yeah. seen one before? No, I saw. I just just the demo, like you know, the, the wow. when he did. The, uh, yeah. Yeah. I this is know, crazy. I they released them at all. This is crazy. This is it's beautiful, ain't it? This. Yeah. This look like is that you wouldn't even want to drive the motherfucker. It's so damn nice. You just like I got it. Yeah. Or, or, or you just go out and drive whatever you want. Cause you, yeah. It's like the um, the, the the thing from the Batman movies. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna get my daughter. Oh, yeah, I'm already yeah, over yeah, time. Yeah. She live in Atlanta. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. You mind yeah. if you take okay. a picture of it? Yeah, go ahead. But look, y'all, make sure y'all comment, like, subscribe. We are gonna do the video. Tap in. Tell them your YouTube name. Honey Drip Network and Aristotle, you know what's going on. Honey Drip Network and Aristotle, let's get it.
and he sponsored Honey Pack. So he actually started the brand of Honey Packs. Oh, yeah. So if you guys definitely want to tap in with it, look at, oh, look so how he looking like you did. Oh, look how type shit. Yeah, that's my look. Brand. So at the end of the day, man, y'all never know who y'all talking to. Y'all never know who y'all tapping into. Relationships get you far. You know what I'm saying? So just know that. And yeah. we in Atlanta, baby. So tap in with my boy, and we're going to get the interview in. Appreciate you. Know what it is. ATL. Here's up. You already know what it is, your boy Aristotle Investments. If you're trying to learn how to invest or trade, Funny Marco is learning. So make sure you tap in, click the link in the description, or it'll be pinned in the comments, and we'll get you squared away. We're gonna teach you everything you need to know about how to invest so you can buy things like this, cyber trucks, yeah. anything you want. I bought this with trading money. You already know what it is, tap in. You seen one like that before, hey you? <laughs> you ain't seen nothing like that. Look, <laughs> click the link in the bio, man, and let's get into it. And like I said, I'm glad to have these relationships and walk in faith and meet these people, you feel me? So once upon a time, a nigga was working at Popeyes. And just because you work at Popeyes don't mean that you have to have a Popeyes mindset. So let's tap in with you, y'all. Let's learn together. I'm learning too. So he doing big things. Let's do it together. Mindset thing. You know, we teach you everything we know. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Get out your feelings and get your back. Get out your feelings.